Hello, Giants fans. Ed Valentine of Big Blue View here with your day one mandatory minicamp report from East Rutherford, New Jersey, as the New York Giants uh, go through their final practices of the uh, 2022 offseason, per se. These practices, of course, are mandatory. Today at uh, Quest Diagnostics, we saw a really, really rough day for the offense. Daniel Jones, Giants quarterback, said the Giants were up and down. Center John Feliciano was a lot more direct, saying we came out with some weak stuff today. Uh, the reality was, I think that the Giants had a difficult time handling some of the things that uh, pseudo, that very aggressive Giants defensive coordinator Wink Martindale was throwing at them in terms of figuring out how to how to block them. I mean, it's very very early, and uh, so, so that kind of thing is to be expected, but uh, definitely a day when, uh, when the defense had the better of the offense, a lot of incomplete passes, a lot of situations where Giants quarterbacks were uh, trying to get out of the pocket, uh, trying to find something to do with the football. I'm not going to read a whole lot into it. Just a, a really, really good day uh, for the Giants defense and a bad one for the offense. So, uh, so, so there was that. We did get uh, a little bit of, of news from uh, East Rutherford today. First, uh, Daniel Jones and Brian Dable both admitted that Jones, who missed the last six games last season with a uh, strained neck, has been cleared for contact and could play in a game if the Giants had one this weekend, which obviously they do not. But that is good news. Jones is 100% healthy and ready to go. So the, uh, the no lingering effects, no lasting effects from the neck injury. So uh, that, that issue is, uh, is in the rearview mirror. The other bit of news that we got today was that uh, Coach Dable confirmed that the Giants will hold a joint practice against the uh, the New York Jets before their August 28th preseason game at MetLife Stadium. That joint practice is expected to be held at the at the Giants practice facility at the Quest Diagnostics Training Center, not across the parking lot at MetLife Stadium. Don't know what day that practice will be, if it'll be uh, the Tuesday, Wednesday, or Thursday, you know, before the, the preseason game. Giants weren't ready to, uh, to give an exact date, but uh, Brian Dable did confirm that, uh, that the Jets will, uh, will be uh, coming from Florham Park, invading the Quest Diagnostics Training Center and uh, practicing against the Giants uh, prior to... Uh, Prior to that uh, preseason finale on on August 28th, so uh, second day of uh, mini camp will be on Wednesday. Uh, yours truly will uh, will be in attendance in East Rutherford again. So please check out all of our coverage at BigBlueView.com. Uh, check us out on Facebook, on Instagram. Follow us on Twitter at Big Blue View. Um, anywhere uh, pretty much anywhere you consume your information you can you can find us on uh, you can you can find us on that platform if you're watching on youtube uh, you know please like and subscribe if you are listening on uh, big blue view radio you know please uh, please subscribe wherever you listen to your podcasts all right giants fans thank you uh, very very much and we'll talk to you again uh, on uh, on wednesday after uh, after the second uh, practice of mandatory minicamp. All right, bye-bye now.